Hello everyone to another Katan video here on colonist.io and to my road to top 100 series. This is my seventh placement game. So I'm still playing my placements game at a fairly good pace. I think one game a day so far. Uh, let's take a look at the board. I noticed that there is not a lot of wheat. I mean, eight and six are available, but uh, it's not like I will be able to get the six has already been picked up. So I don't think going for eight, four, three would make much sense either. So based on that, I think uh, nine, four, 11 might be open for me. Not a lot of uh, brick available on this board, but quite some amount of uh, wheat, av sorry, wood available. Your orange goes for 834. I think orange can pair it up with. Uh, sorry, orange goes for 8310. Orange can pair it up with 834 here. And based on the current placements, I like the 659. Uh, I think I will be able to pair it up with something like uh, 6. Uh, 311 and then I should be able to get to the wood port. It is a risky strategy though. Uh, playing without any ore and wheat might turn out to be quite a bit of a headache. But um, maybe I can also get something like 9411 or 9102 as my second pick. 6, 11, 12 is also an option that I have if I go for 9, 6, 4. Yeah, so just considering all my options. Here, I think just going for 6, 9, 5 is fine. Green can go for something like uh, 8, 4 and 8, 3, 4 or maybe 9, 4, 11 and 8, 3, 4. If that happens, I think I will go for, although I did mention 6311, but now I think 8, uh, uh, 4, 5, 11 is also a fine choice for me. So uh, does go for 834, I did expect that. And a little surprised that um, Green goes for 6311 and points to the right. That is even more surprising here. But based on that, I think now I have to go for 9411, get some wheat, a pretty good ore. Although I will be playing without any brick, I think I will be able to get to either the 910 or the 510 option here. And this will also let uh, orange go for 4, 5, 11, or oh, sorry, uh, 5, 4. If I go for 9, 10, 11, orange will go for 4, 5, 11. I don't want that. And I'm not sure if I should be pointing my road to the left. There is some chance that orange goes for 9, 10, 2 points to the right, starts with a dev card and tries to get to 6-2. Also red here I think would want to go for something like 5-10-2 if it is open. So pointing to the left doesn't make much sense. There is no point pointing in the right. Pointing upwards 5-4 is the only option. But I think there is a very good chance 5-4 is going to be picked up by someone else. Maybe I can go for 5, 4, 11, but uh, yeah, I think I'll go for 9, 4, 11 here. And I will point my road to the left. I, I mean, maybe I should actually, I will point it upwards. If needed, I might be able to connect my settlements and go for the longest road. And now more than the wood port, I think getting to the 910 
थ्री टू वन पोर्ट इज इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर मी फर्स्टली बिकॉज दैट विल बी हेल्पफुल विथ ऑल द शीप एंड वुड वुड आई प्रोड्यूस बट ऑल्सो गिव मी सम ओवर प्रोडक्शन सॉरी ब्रिक प्रोडक्शन यर आई डेड एक्सपेक्ट ऑरेंज टू गो फॉर नाइन टेन टू वाई डोंट आई डोंट माइंड दिस सेटअप एट ऑल इट्स अ प्रिटी गुड सेटअप फॉर मी रेड गोइंग फॉर एट फाइव दैट क्विकली इज प्रिटी गुड I do know that green has some brick in hand, so I will steal from green here. I do get the brick that I'm looking for, and as I have mentioned, I'll go towards nine ten first. Nine is an excellent roll for me. Wow, back to back eights are very good for everyone but me. Orange plays a year of plenty, so I think Orange will be going for a city here. Uh, should be getting a city on nine ten two. Yeah, just to increase their uh, wheat production makes complete sense. And here, based on the cards I have, I'll just end my turn. Red should be able to get a city soon enough. red might want to block the six word but uh, okay blocks the three or i don't mind that might steal from green trying to look for some word or break wow so that's a very strong i mean just a non steal doesn't help much so <laughs> here now <laughs> orange is offering a 1 is to 2 after accepting a non steal yeah i just wouldn't say anything here although i would want to put some fuel to the fire but i'll just stay mum and i roll a 7 so red loses out on four cards and here i will surely steal from red i do get an or uh, doesn't help me much at this point i don't think anybody has any brick in hand uh let's see if i get this trade here I will be able to get a dev card if this trade goes on. I don't. I mean, I don't know if there is any other option that I have. Uh, although my wheat production isn't the best, I think I just have to go for a development card. And getting a year of plenty is excellent for me. this is i mean obviously i don't mean it in a very serious way roll at 12 not much that i can do with the cards i have in hand uh let's see if somebody accepts this trade how about a 1 is to 1 
either of these would give me a settlement on the 9 10 spot on the other hand if yeah i don't think red is going to accept any trade your green rolls the 7 i think green has to block the 9 or okay blocks the 8 or and steals from orange which makes complete sense here let's see if i can get a 1 is to 2 okay gets a trade with orange okay i don't mind getting this trade i mean although i am giving green a city uh, i don't think green is in a very strong position at this point just yet a uh, nine rolls here so i think i will just get a settlement on 4 5 before getting a settlement on actually i can also get a city if i play my year of plenty uh let's see if i get this trade here yeah unfortunate that uh, nobody is accepting any of my trades okay actually orange accepts it so now here i will surely go for a city and play my year of plenty and get a settlement so a huge turn there for me and getting a city on 9411 is huge because 9 will only be blocked by rare or green and no one else and now each nine roll is extra special for me or uh, giving me two sheep and two holes that's i think the first four of the game and pretty good one for me your green is getting a little lucky because of the eights and threes that have been rolling recently yeah red blocks the four wheat which is fine i would have preferred if red blocked the eight wheat but uh, not much that i can do at this point green rolls a seven green will lose out on quite a few cards should block the nine over and uh, steal from okay, continue to block the eight i don't mind that at all yeah so i would want a couple of tens to roll just so that i can get to the 8 4 spot oh, sorry 5 4 spot before green can and 11 rolls here Let's see if I can get this trade. I don't think uh, orange would accept it. So at this point, I'll just do a three to one. And I know people aren't targeting me; uh, they are more focused on orange. So for that reason, I'll just hold on to these cards and end my turn. I would surely want to cut off uh, orange from getting to the five four spot. I roll a seven. Here, I think just blocking the three sheep is fine. I know green doesn't have any sheep in hand, and I do get a brick, so that's huge for me. 
now just considering if i should build my road or build my settlement on 54 on 910 or sorry 510 i think 510 is slightly better increases my brick production and four wheat will be blocked most of the time so yeah i'll just do that here get my settlement on 510 and a 10 rolls immediately so that's pretty good for me Your red rolls the seven should block uh, target me. Yeah, does target me. I think that's expected. My next target is to get a city on the six five nine spot. Yeah, these eights are really huge or uh, really strong for green, and so are sixes. So green is actually getting very lucky with these sixes and eights. Making huge progress on every turn. Yeah, so green basically cuts me off from getting the longest roll. And uh, three rolls here, that's a huge roll for green again. So I think I've been a little unlucky with my rolls, uh, not getting exactly the rolls that I wanted. Like fours and nah, tens have rolled. Uh, have not rolled much. I think 9 has rolled only once or maybe twice this entire game. Not a lot of 5s either. So yeah, I mean, I've been a little unlucky here. I think at this point, I do need to slow down green. I get a sheep, which is completely alright. Let me just try and get a dev card. I would hope that it's not a knight because I don't want to be fighting for the largest army in this game. Wow. Green is just so lucky. We'll be able to get at least two dev cards this turn. Gets one. Okay, just gets one and ends the turn. Yeah. 10 is a pretty good roll for me. I would want a 11 to roll so that I can stop green from connecting. In this case, instead of uh, a knight, a road building would have been excellent for me. Your orange and red are fighting for the largest army, most likely. Here I have to just play my knight just to unblock myself. And I will continue to target green. Green already is in a very strong position. And I get a word, but at this point, I'm not sure if I should be building my road downwards. Green can easily block me. And I don't even have, I mean, I can build on 912, but I don't think it helps me too much at this point. So based on all that, I think I'll just hold on to these cards. Surely green doesn't have a knight here. Red gets the largest army. So red is also in a very strong position. I, there is no way I think I can win this game. You are a roll of four. I think the best I can do is go for a single dev card. I. 
can just build three roads try and uh, stop green from getting the longest road but i don't think it is something that i should be focused on so far i mean nines and fives haven't rolled in such a long time i do get another knight a little unfortunate was hoping to get something like a uh, monopoly or something of anything else would have been fine yeah that's a rare five i would say and uh, yeah so plays a monopoly takes away the word which is not the worst i would say i mean although it does get rid of one word in my hand in any case here let's see it's i think it's just going for a settlement orange is much far behind everyone else in the game I think just blocking the eight over is fine now. Need to focus on red. I do get an over, so that's good. I will be able to get another dev card, and as I wanted, I do get a road building. So I would want a couple of elevens to roll. Wow, green steals from me. That's a little unfortunate. and yeah red is also stealing from me yeah really unfortunate now but i i think green did not have any cards in hand and that's why red stole from me uh four rolls exactly when it's blocked don't want to see that at all i think here 11 is the best roll for me that would at least give me the longest road Not sure why orange is solo targeting green. Instead, I roll a five here. Let's see if I can get this trade. Maybe I'll do it like this. A two is to two. Red accepts it. Uh, At this point I don't think I'm fighting for the lead so maybe I will just accept it with red Yeah So surely trying to take the longest road away from green now I do still need to build one more road green steals from me yeah i don't think red can win in this turn but red is very close to winning for sure wow i mean yeah eights have rolled even if i mean if green steals from me not much that i can do anything about it should steal from red yeah very unfortunate that green is also targeting me now so now i need a 10 to roll so that i can at least get the longest road this turn green surely should have blocked the 8 or i think this is a complete mistake on green's part orange plays their second monopoly not a lot but still gets something out of it mostly stole from green yeah 
so i think that's just gg for me i will end this game on the last position now green can easily get a few dev cards and i mean orange is still trading with green so that's just game over so yeah as as i said i will end this game on the last position they yeah, had the dice statistics were completely unfair here 8s and 3s and 10s i think were the most common numbers uh yeah and i mean yeah completely not something that i could have done anything about in this game nine rolled only twice this entire game fives rolled thrice fours rolled only thrice so yeah i mean this game has to be the epitome of i think my numbers weren't bad but uh, just the dice did not want me to win also dev cards i think i would have been in a much better position if i had monopoly or uh some anything else i got a couple of knights which did not help me in any way at all resource stat yeah my resource production was very bad i was very dependent on nines which did not happen at all uh getting maybe a city getting a city on 954 would have been better in hindsight because sixes did roll a little whereas nines fours and elevens uh, didn't roll at all like yeah actually 94 and 11 combined rolled seven times whereas six itself rolled 10 times so absolutely not much that i could have done this game just a bystander i would say also orange accepting this trade in the end i mean surely a mistake there and uh, yeah so that's it for now um this was my seventh placement game little disappointing but uh, this is how it is sometimes uh, overall my uh, out of the seven placement game i think i have won five so i have had a pretty good run so far uh, so i cannot complain much regarding being unlucky for sure anyway yeah bye for now and see you again in the next video bye bye